Job hunting during the pandemic is really rough. I had a, a pretty steady job and then COVID hit and the security company I was working for lost contracts. And so uh, I was eventually let off in the middle in the middle of the pandemic, which caused, uh, you know, kind of a ripple effect of, you know, bills and things of that nature. Frederick and his family came into our program just under a year ago. Um, they came into our program homeless. Uh, they have a new baby that just turned one. The stigma and stereotypes and, you know, different perceptions that are all, not always positive that comes with people being homeless is just unfortunate. I work with many families that definitely want the help. They are motivated to get the help and they just need a hand up. I'm just excited as you are about these opportunities for your family. I definitely appreciate you. Uh giving me the opportunity or giving me the resource for the opportunity. Homelessness is a issue that is multi-dimensional. We know that economic um, security and the lack of economic security is one big reason why folks fall into homelessness. Yeah, I think we could dump it all in. And when you take the time to talk to our unhoused neighbors, what you consistently hear is that they don't want handouts. They want opportunities. That's what this program offers, an opportunity for a good paying job, an opportunity to get a roof over your head. Homelessness creates a lot of barriers to gaining employment. You don't have a permanent address. It might be some time before you had a job. This program addresses that by um, connecting individuals that are in emergency shelters. You know, we do the recruitment events there. Folks are able to fill out their applications at the emergency shelters as well and get um, you know, conditional job offers on the spot. You're going to be part of our team, so we want you to represent us. Those guys kind of put on a mini job fair for the community, and um, I absolutely took that opportunity to at least come and see what they were offering um, from a very small town. And so the, jo the best jobs in town are, you know, with the city or with the county. The opportunity in front of us right now and that we're really uh, maximizing is this multi-pronged approach that isn't just about these parks jobs here today, but it's about the impact that we're creating in our community. You get a chance to really impact folks who have been really impacted by the COVID uh, pandemic that we're going through. And we give folks a chance to, to have some really good jobs and taking care of our parks at a much needed time. Seeing from day one until now the looks on their faces and the, their demeanor changing, knowing that they're feeling good after a hard day of work and that they're earning a wage, it's been super rewarding. Um, it's something I think they don't realize is uh, they're helping us in the parks, but uh, for me, I mean, it's helping me up here and in here, and uh, it's been it's been great. Particularly, what I'm doing right now is uh, removing the weeds. I feel great just being employed again, able to put food on the table for my family, just to have you know a steady income coming in. It's it's always a great feeling. I used to run the landscaping business, so this is right up my alley. I am very appreciative for King County for choosing me for this, and so for that, I definitely want, wanted to uh, express the uh, gratitude I feel, you know, for this opportunity. So I definitely look at it like a blessing.